One of the utilities Apple includes with Mac OS X is Color Sync. Using this application, you have the ability to maximize the thresholds, gamma, and temperature on your monitor, also known as calibration. This tip will show you how to calibrate your monitor to achieve its optimum color properties. To start the calibration utility, you go to the Apple menu and select System Preferences. Select the Display Preference. In the Display Preference pane, you click on the Color tab to access the profiles for your monitor. On the right, you will see a Calibrate button. When you click this button, it will bring up the Display Calibration Assistant. Make sure the Expert Mode button is checked and click Continue. There are five steps involved in this portion of the calibration. You will see two sliders on your screen. The slider on the left controls the brightness of the display. You'll want to adjust this slider so the Apple logo is barely visible. The slider on the right controls the color saturation. When you move this slider, you will notice the tint of your monitor will change. The goal is to make the Apple logo match the outside grid as much as possible. Once you have completed this and the logo is barely visible, click the Continue button and repeat this process. There are five steps in this process that you will need to complete. The next section will be Gamma Selection. If you uncheck the Use Native Gamma, you will be able to adjust the slider and see the effects. In most cases, the Native Gamma is sufficient, so I'm going to leave mine checked. The next selection is Native White Point Selection. Again, if you uncheck the Use Native White Point and adjust the slider, you can make the display warmer or cooler depending on your environment. When you click Continue, you will be prompted as to whether you would like to allow all users of this display to have access to the calibration you're creating. After you have completed these steps, you will need to name your profile. I'm going to name mine Calibrated Display. You can create multiple calibrations for your display for different uses. When you click Continue, it will give you a summary of all the settings you just made. Click the Done button and your new profile will show up in Display Profiles. If you click Between Profiles, you can see the changes to your display immediately. You can perform this step as many times as you like to ensure your display is as sharp and vivid as you prefer it to be.